Come bless the Lord, all you servants of the Lord, you that by night stand in the house of the Lord. Lift up your hands towards the sanctuary and bless the Lord, the Lord who made heaven and earth, give you his blessing out of Zion. Thus may the Lord Almighty, our God and Saviour, grant us a quiet night and a perfect end. For our help is in the name of this Lord, who made heaven and earth. As we come to the end of this day, we acknowledge our need of forgiveness. And so we say, most merciful God, we confess to you before the whole company of heaven and one another that we have sinned in thought, word and deed, and in what we have failed to do. Forgive us our sins, heal us by your Spirit, and raise us to new life in Christ. Amen. With the confidence that our requests are answered, we say before the ending of the day, Creator of the world, we pray that you with steadfast love would keep your watch around us while we sleep. But before we sleep, we want to hear from God in his word. And tonight we listen to Psalm 34, verse 18, in which we read, It is the Lord who is closest to those whose hearts have been broken in pieces. He will certainly save those whose spirits have been crushed into dust. Sometimes our lives seem broken into a thousand pieces, with no prospect that recovery and repair is possible. Like the psalmist, we too can feel as if we've been squelched under a hobnailed boot. What comfort then, to know there is one closer than the dearest of our friends and loved ones, and one who can and will in his time fully restore us. Blessed Lord, you are nearer to us than we can imagine and we are far dearer to you than we can conceive. When we are shattered, pick up the pieces. When the life is squeezed out of us, please, please be our hope and our deliverer. Abide with us, Lord Jesus, for the night is at hand, and the day is now past. As the night watch looks for the morning, so do we look for you, O Christ. So may the Lord our God, Father, Son and Holy Spirit bless us and watch over us. May the Lord make his face shine upon us and be gracious to us. May the Lord look kindly on us and give us his peace.